Cristiano Ronaldo Jr. is one of the world's most outstanding young talents. Of course, there's no two ways about it, especially having such genes. You've probably heard about his amazing stats in the first year in the Juventus U9 youth team, 58 goals and 18 assists in 28 matches. You don't have to be a football genius to understand, that is hell of a lot and seems very promising. We have repeatedly told you about Junior, calling him the machine and the beast. Today we want to tell you another story about Cristianinho, after which you will definitely have no doubts on that kind of a thought. This guy was born to replace his father at the Football Olympus. But before we start, traditionally, a minute of advertising from our friends. We are glad to inform you about our new project called Footballinho. We invite all Portuguese-speaking subscribers of our channel. We will leave the links to Futbolinho in the description, pinned comment and the final screen. Guys, we kindly ask you to support our initiative. After all, we are doing all this just for you. Subscribe and share the link with your Brazilian or Portuguese friends and with those who will find this channel convenient. Well, we are about to start. The career of a young footballer in a top club is not as easy as it looks. From an early age you get used to a rather tough schedule, daily training, a lot of matches and traveling. Ronaldo Jr. has already tested the life of a mini-professional at his fullest. Juventus frequently participates in international tournaments and today we are to mention one such trip. A very pleasant trip for Cristiano Ronaldo's son. In April of 2019, Cristianinho and Juventus U10 took part in a tournament held in the homeland of the great CR7, Madeira Island, the city of Funchal. The tournament was called Torneo Internacional de Futebol de Maritimo. The consistency of participants was very, very impressive. If you're familiar with the names of such clubs as Juventus, Atletico Madrid, Porto and Benfica, in general, Chris Jr. and his gang had to try hard to win gold medals. And Cristianinho did everything to make the whole world talk about him. In the first match of the tournament, Juventus defeated the local Maritimo, and Cristianinho netted 7 goals in the first half. The mini old lady won that match with a score of 25-0. It was the day when Cristiano Ronaldo Jr. shocked the world of football. After that, the striker didn't stop to play absolutely great. In the second match, Juve once again easily withstanded the opponent. This time it went to the modest club Camacha. 15-1. Carish Jr. made a panta trick here. In total we have 12 goals in two matches. That's what I call crazy stats. Ronaldo Dean slowed down his pace and smashed opponents throughout the tournament, having set the following indicators of 25 goals in 8 matches. In addition to the status of the top scorer and the best player of the tournament, Cristianinho and his team won the Golden Cup. In the finals, Juventus turned out to be stronger than Atletico Madrid. That away performance was a real fairy tale for Chris Jr. World famous publishers such as Us, Sport Bible, and Give Me Sport wrote about his scoring achievements. It was the competition in Maritimo which has become another irrefutable proof. The top football player of the future is growing right in front of our eyes. Against the background of his peers, Cristiano Jr. looks like a boy from another planet, just like his father at the time. I hope Cristianinho will be as good as I am. He says that he will be even better than me, but it is very difficult to succeed. I am very happy about his football success. I dream that he will become a professional footballer. He plays for Juventus and has adapted very well. It will be easier for him to get to the top level than for me. From an early age he feels the pressure playing for such a big club like Juventus and he takes challenges very well. Be in sports, quotes Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, let's summarize all things mentioned. 25 goals in 8 matches in the Maritimo, top scorer and player of the tournament, 7 goals in one half, performances for Juventus and being the strongest player in the team, taking one individual award after another. Friends, aren't you impressed yet? Guys, press like if you enjoyed another story about Cristiano Ronaldo Jr.'s football achievements. 
subscribe to the channel if you want to continue the topic. You can also rate Christian Inu's performance in the comments below on a 10-point scale. Well, it was Inside Football. We watch football from a different angle. Have a nice one and see you in a bit.